Welcome to the Puppy Training Tips video series, where we answer the most common puppy care and training questions. Today's question is, what are the best collars to use when I train my puppy? Having the right collar for training will allow for easier correction of unwanted behaviors and will ensure that your puppy and those around you are safe. Here are several collar choices for you to consider. Nylon flat collars are among the most commonly seen dog collars around. They lay flat against a dog's neck and are typically fastened by a buckle. They come in different colors and are a great way to display your dog's tags. Unfortunately, this type of collar is not a good choice for training because when a leash pulls on it, it can press on the neck, causing harm. A more effective way of restraining your puppy during training is with a body harness. The harness wraps around the midsection of your dog and will prevent him from leaping away, at you, away from you when you are holding the lead. The harness does not apply any pressure to the neck. Next is the head collar. These types of collars look like a muzzle in that they wrap around the dog's head. They don't cover the mouth, however, so your puppy can still bark, eat, and drink. The head collar works differently from other collars in that a pull on the lead redirects the dog's head by applying pressure to the top of the muzzle. It is considered to be a humane and effective means of controlling your dog. Choker collars are metal collars that go around the neck that cinch when the lead is pulled. These collars are dangerous and frowned upon by trainers. Pinch collars have dull prongs which exert pressure around the neck when the leash is pulled. These collars are used mainly for strong, stubborn dogs and usually are just temporary. As you can see, there are several different choices for collars. Your best bet for puppy training classes is to use a harness or head collar as they are effective and not harmful to your dog. To help you out more, we've listed some resources below we thought you might find useful.